we're searching for Magister Verdun, I think. Emotions are running high for Amicia as she kind of feels like all the promises that she feels like she's made to Hugo were. That's an entrance hall. How do we get upstairs? I see no door. But these sorts of iron bells. Look, they bear planet symbols. And here, the sun sits in their center. The order of the planets is not right. How does the whole thing work? There are locks for a key under each bell. It's one big mechanism. But we don't have a key, so... I think the key makes each bell pivot. But your sling may do the trick. Let's try from the left. All right. From left to right, the correct order is... Jupiter, Mars, the Sun, Venus, and Mercury. Jupiter's symbol looks like a Z. Like for Zeus. Okay. Is, that's not what you meant, is it? There you go. That's it. Jupiter. What's next? To Jupiter's right is Mars, the god of war. It's a shield crossed by a spear. A spear, a shield. That's it. Venus is the first to the right of the sun. It's shaped like a necklace. Mercury, god of commerce. He carries a staff with two snakes intertwined. Mercury symbol is two snakes intertwined. I'm done. That's all of them, I think. Yes! Oh, look! That wall's a door! It's so archaic! Good work. Let's go find this Magister. Awesome. Look at the detail in the... in the mosaic. The sun. Let's just have a little look around. Previous members of the order looks quite Roman. Maybe. We are very close to Italy. Now, obviously, it wouldn't be called Italy at this time in history. It, it, Italy, as it is today, only came into existence about 100 and, 150, 180 years ago, I think. I think until, like, the mid-1800s, Italy was just split into its various states. Um, and Rome had obviously shrunk to just being quite small and then they all banded together to make Italy uh, fairly in quite recently in terms of the history all right we might have just let all the rats in Magister Vaudin, I'm Amicia de Rune. Her daughter. That explains why those brutes downstairs are so quiet. The Order was quite impressed by the way you put down the Inquisition in Guyenne. Well, I didn't have a choice. Not a choice. A calling. That of a carrier's protector. A what? A protector. Your function among the Order. Wait, I'm not. And you are? I'm Lucas. I'm an alchemist too. An apprentice. Does your magistrate know you entitle yourself? Who cares? The macula's woken up again. My brother needs your help and the rats are already there. Control your flame protector. Others are burned in it. Take my bag. Let's go see that carrier.
Okay. Magister Verdun. Where is he? It's upstairs. God. How are you doing? I'm scared. Hugo, this is Magister Verdun. Hello. We should start immediately. I will need silence. Mother. I'll handle it. Chapter 3 A Burden of Blood. Mm -hmm. Not sure I trust this Magister. Oh. <sighs> Lucas, come right now. Coming! I heard you go cry. What's going on? He didn't react well. He's having a seizure. What? Mother! You must stop this. We don't know this man. Amicia, this sort of thing was always likely. And this man is an exalted member of the most ancient college of alchemists that exists. The Order knows the macula. Hugo is not alone. I'm here. We need Nightshade as soon as possible to calm the tremors. There is a herbalist in the outskirts of the city. It's at the other end of the Butcher's District, at the edge of the forest. Do you see? Of course. I'm coming. I feel useless here anyway. Mm. Bit of rain. Oh, rain. We have a long way to go. Let's not waste time. Oh, look at the rain. I, I love miserable winter weather in games. And um, that voice actor who Vaudan was, who's playing Vaudan, is um, his name's escaping me, but he, the, the Nilf Guardian official in The Witcher 3. His name is... Oh, it's, it's close. He's the one who explains the situation on the continent to Geralt in the Nilfgaardian embassy in... Things are getting worse and worse. I know you're worried. Azima. You should give Magister Vodon some time. Time? To do what? Make Hugo feel even worse? Yeah. He's conducting tests. But he knows what he's doing. He's the most competent in his domain. Oh, oh, enough of that! He's been treating my brother like an animal! No. We need another solution. Like... This island Hugo dreams of. Interesting. What can we do with the dream, Amicia? Just... Keep caring about him, please. Yeah. I care. But it's not enough anymore. Yeah, but care about him and not the macula. Like, he's more important than the macula. And like, this Magister, none of these guys actually have any first-hand experience of dealing with the macula, right? Because it's something that pops up very rarely in history, right? Their order is prepared to deal with it, but they, they, they're they simply not... The individuals involved aren't old enough to have actually dealt with it themselves. I mean, he was very disdainful, very superior in his attitude. Not just towards us as children, which you might expect from older people in this time period, but towards Beatrice as well, who's obviously put in a bit too much faith in his abilities or knowledge. Sorry, I like to walk when we get the chance, right? Before we have to deal with more mercenaries or something. But I suppose Amicia's feelings, we are a protector as we were described as before, so we're naturally going to want to protect Hugo from anyone and everyone. So we're going to be suspicious of every anyone, basically. Everybody's gone. Yeah, weather effects are a really good, a really good way to. to I can't believe they've got the way to the arena. What's happened down there? 
Uh, Tang Nong, there was that smell. Yeah. Hope it don't take long. All right, our gate should be over there. Oh, that stinks. Well, that means we're on the right path. Yeah, butchers, right? There it is. But yeah, like weather effects are a really good way to transform levels, right? And reuse areas from like, I think from like a game design point of view. Uh, you, it allows you to reuse areas and levels and make them look different and feel different even though you don't actually have to do as much work to redesign them. Or to, you know, rather than create a, 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 another level or another area. Alright, you ready? Yes, let's go. There is a chance that some of those beekeepers are still alive, and they did mention this market in particular. I don't know how, because um, I don't think we killed all of them. Oh, rotten flesh. Yes, it's the butcher's district. It's the shortest way to the herbalist. Rain's Come eased on, off. Good people. I've got all the poultry you could ever want. Pork, pork, to rose, to boil. Tastiest meat in the world. Looks tasty for sure. <laughs> oh, God. Like entrails everywhere. If you never tried beef, you don't know what you're missing. There's the city gate. We're not there yet. And Hugo might even be getting worse right now. Let's hurry. It will be all right. One thing I always really wish games would do more is, is have multiple walking speeds and running speeds. Like, at least three different walking speeds, th three different running speeds. Because, look, like that that's too slow, that's too fast. In my opinion. Uh oh. Dad is all alone. Oh. I'll go soon, Mum. What's going on? We oh, left her throne. What's this? Nothing good, is it? This district is now closed what? by the authority of the Count Victor of Arl. For your own safety, do not try to get inside. You can't keep us out. No, you go can't wait. There might be another way in. Tell us what's happening! Our children are in there! Right? There's a back alley through there. What do you think? Do you see a way in? Wait. Where's the go? I think. Yes. Good job, Lucas. Through here, Missy. Grandmaster Sleuth Lucas. Just passing. Entrails everywhere. Christ. The rats are going to be drawn here like a moth to a flame. Oh, you must be joking. The butcher's done. We're going in there. Yikes. Big yikes. Let's have a quick check as to how our stats are progressing. Also, we can craft from the menu. We can craft Ignifers from a... I don't think that this is an active pause. I think people could still attack us here. So we are... Prudence is going up the most. Uh, 
Right. Okay, so these souvenirs, these are like memories. I hope we get to collect objects again, things that give us a nice bit of history. So the herbarium is from the previous game, I think, and Hugo's collection is from this game. So let's read this. Uh, this tiny white star is a colony farming aquatic wildflower often found in shallow lakes and castle moats. Moats. Its genus name, Sagitt Sagitta, means arrow in Latin and comes from the shape of its leaves. It's also known as duck potato as it produces corms, which are usually eaten stewed. It's said to absorb large amounts of heavy metallic elements such as copper or lead. Two of the seven pure metals in alchemy. And that's what we've got equipped. Great, we're gonna... Just hold your breath. We're gonna have to slide down the meat slide. Oh! Oh, that's how you catch the plague right there. Oh, you... He's a scientist. Losing my mind. Yeah. But it takes me closer to losing mine. Just think of it as matter. Being transformed. I'm going to vomit. Oh Lord. My boots are ruined. The ground is soaked with blood. Like the arena. Oh, this whole place is just bait. Yeah. And uh, it's very nearly do evening, and the rats are going to show up any moment. Look, we've got a, a brazier, <laughs> right? Crafting materials showing up. We're going to need some ignifers. Chicken cages. Lock. There's a cart in the way. We have to keep going. Help me with this. Yes. Oh God. No, not them, not again. Oh God, I missed. Right, there's another brazier there. The fires won't be bright enough to let us cross. Yeah, we need to use a pot. There aren't any sticks, are there? Yeah, that's we can't get over there. Um, there's no rats here, so... Whoa, 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 Lucas. They want that hanging carcass, right? Of course they do. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Um... I just don't think there's anything else for us to do here. They can't reach it. They're bad. It's like the ones in the cart. Try hitting it with your sling. Uh, shoot a rock with your sling at a bag of saltpeter to create a cloud that extinguishes flames and suffocates enemies. Nice. No way. 
only preserves meat, but it's thick enough to choke the flames. This is more salt, Peter, right? Yes, a lot of it. Um, I don't know what we need this for, but... If the people outside knew what's happening, they have family here, children. There's no way the army can hide that. It's gonna be chaos, Lucas. Yes. Lord, it's infested. Paul, let's leave now! Wait! The light! Townsfolk. I guess. How many are there left? That's close enough. Come, don't stay there. Wait, I'm taking some. This stuff is too useful. All right, it's all yours now. Can I take I some? It. Stay back. Now the fire. Yes. Yes, well done. Oh god. Come on, quick. I really hope we find our herbalist in this mess. He's outside the city, right? So maybe he's safe. God, so many carcasses. They think they're infected. Yeah, yeah. Oh, you won't go farther. God, that bite has killed faster than us. He'll execute us on sight. It's us or them now. You go, go, wait. We need that night shape box. Give me the salt, Peter. Listen, you can use that salt nature against me. Yeah. So we still, so we still need, um, so that's alcohol, uh, I can't remember what that was, but. Now we can do this from stealth if we're close enough. Yes, indeed. We did it in the past, but it's still disturbing. Yes, I may have to use it again. Anyway, thanks. I, I don't think that there's a timer on the meat in the bodies. It's sulfur. Sorry. Yeah. Can't get in there anyway. They would sometimes drop loot, I think, in the first game. Yeah, see? Oh, 
I don't want to waste the Ignifer, so... Remember to mark the houses you've cleaned with a cross! It's imperative that the bodies are taken out of the city! Sure, take the bodies out. The rats will follow. How can they be so stupid? Right, so there is a thing made of salt saltpeter underneath here. I wonder how far that that would go if we punctured it. So we can't really get through here. There are multiple light sources, so we need to go left. Oh crap. Strange. He's not coming down. That was uh, rubbish timing on my heart. I don't know why we'd need this, but... We must leave the city. Keep this boat down behind. For what, Amicia? A dream of an island. A dream he's been having for weeks. Yeah. We just told the whole district. Head to the damn story. So I imagine... We don't need that just yet. But let's if this puffs out a cloud all the way up. Whoa, what are you doing, rat? Whatever made that snap must be close. That didn't work. Damn it, I've wasted that. Sorry, mate. Bit harsh. I should have. I could have used a pot to distract him, I suppose. But I know we probably don't need this, but. Oh, wait a minute. Let's try getting rid of these rats because there's probably some loot underneath. to do that. And uh, maybe there was a torch on the wall. No? You bastards really seem to like me. I don't think this will work. I think we just get it. I think we just get spotted. Oops. 
I needed to get him to come specifically that way, right? Yeah. So if we get if, if we get him to spot us through the window, that's probably the way to do it. Now, how am I going to handle this? I need to kill the rats with it, I think, is the, is the difference. I need to corner them and burn them. If I die again, though, I'm very sorry. But... I need to throw a pot at them, maybe. Mine. How are you supposed to get there? That's bizarre. Why can't I figure that out? I'm just not going to bother. Okay, I don't think we need the stick then. Got someone stationed at the top? I don't think so. I right, might as well use this stick. Can we see any other loot? Tools allow you to upgrade your equipment at a workbench.
Alright, we should be able to get past. Okay, Lucas. What's the button I used to get him to do stuff? Never mind, he'll do it automatically. We're going to have a problem. What? There's no break on this thing, so we'll have to run. That's it. Release on my go. Interesting. They don't care about walls. Take care about food. I don't see any soldiers either. Hey, I've just remembered. In Bodan's laboratory, th there was a fresco with an island on it. I saw it, Lucas. What about that? Bodan must know about it. All right, all right. I'll try to ask. Thank you. Now. Mother said the herbalist lives at the edge of a forest. We should be close. Alright. Let's look out for a workbench. Nothing. Well, maybe we need to be looking out for herbs and stuff. For Hugo's little gathering stuff. It's so quiet. It feels off. There were people here not too long ago. No blood. No sign of a fight. Where are they? Let's take advantage of this for now. Sure. Well, let's go left for... oh, maybe not. Right, there might be a workbench in here. Someone used that forge recently. Hey, there's a workbench here. You can improve your gear with it. You should take a look right now. We don't know what awaits us. You're right. Oh. Alright. Sling. Um, less noise when she uses it. Alchemy. Uh, sewing new pockets carry additional al alchemical ammo. I like that because there's nothing worse than having to leave resources behind. Gear. A new ringed belt will help Amicia carry an additional jar. That's good. Um... An instrument, a recycling tool, is helpful for breaking jars, knife, pyrites, and bolts into pieces. For me, she has no more room. Uh, I think pockets is a bit of a no-brainer. We're just this is just for jars, whereas this applies to ignifer and to the saltpeter formula to extinguish as well, and whichever else we find. So that has multiple uses, and um, so does that. But the sling upgrade is cheapest. I think, it, yeah. I would like this, but with because we've just got bigger pockets, we hopefully shouldn't need this too often. But yeah, it does say breaking jars down. Uh, let's take the sling. That's better. That'll help. Right, um... Right, let's check downstairs. Hopefully this... Yes, let's go. Oh, there's a body here. 
The rats. No. I should have explored the rest of the village. Stabbed. Probably soldiers. Is this where the quest is supposed to be? I'm not sure. I don't think so. Oh, damn it. No wolf can stop them. Damn it. Carcasses. Yes, they keep falling in the blood. But we don't know where the blood stops. Right, I feel uh, it's, it's the most annoying feeling I remember from the first game when you go through a point of no return door. Let's just craft a few things. I'll save the next one, depending on what happens. Hey! Go! Oh! Watch out! We forgot you. Well, I'll fix that. Christ. I think we can get there. you want us to get past dude well that wasn't revenge oh fine he's right we should I guess they'll pull us in the direction of humanity oh god Beast. Well, the men will panic. I know. All right, we could probably get the, hit them with a, a big giant pot here. Oh, I see what you want me to do. <laughs> God, he's really uh, making us think about what we're doing here. Fair enough, right? I guess I'm wasting resources as well for when we actually need it. Uh, is there a stick in here? Maybe. Doesn't look like it. Right, so I've just killed three men unnecessarily, according to dear Lucas. <laughs> Right, so there's a, I can see a carcass over there. That's just it's blocked, right? I'm using a lot of resources here, man.
Wow, yeah. I mean, I've got to get past a lot of this, so... Just in case it draws any more, you never know. There you go. Alright, let's make our way inside. You never know when the rats will decide they don't want to eat the thing anymore. Right, we can't vault over here, frustratingly. Well, this is kind of... Uh oh. Disgusting creatures. Should have known. Still clear. I think we kind of trapped ourselves here. But... I think I could probably survive four rats, but we'll be out in the open, so... Oh! No, no, no! Ah, I thought... Uh, I'm going to have to go so far back. Oh no, fair enough. Thank you, game. We're going to have to get rid of him, because if he comes over here again... So I can't survive... Wow, Amicia! I'm going to have to backtrack a little bit here. What? Oh. Lucas, get out! I'm not sure where the, uh, any of the enemies are currently. Now we've got sticks here to save us on uh, to save some ignifer. I don't see anyone, which is worrying. Because we move very slowly when we do this. Head inside. See you later, pal. Old buddy, old friend. No rats in here. Nice. Yeah, we're pretty stocked up, so might as well. You're shaking. I'm fine. It'll pass. Yeah, we really need to consider the effect we're having on Amicia here. Okay, Matt. Steady on. Now he might patrol back down here, unfortunately. I could do with another stick. Can I get one? No, I'd have to cross that bit again. We'll have to use an ignifer. They seem fairly dynamic with their What's the herbalist? What are you doing with my boss? That's the herbalist. Right, let's keep an eye on where they actually take him. <laughs> oh! oh, God. 
Yeah, they're um, the way that they're running and walking and stuff is not always the same, right? Right, when he comes around the corner, we'll get rid of his... Press the wrong button again. So maybe we can save the herb list? Unless I've just ruined the checkpoint. Uh, okay. Sorry if this is a bit that's a bit immersion breaking, but Hiding those little bushes. Yeah, it... I'll be sick soon, and I'll laugh as I watch you die. Stop! On your knees now! He's going to kill him. I... I don't know what to do. <laughs> yeah, there was nothing I could do. Oh! Yeah, there's nothing you can do. He's going to get killed by the soldier, or he's going to get killed by the rats. Yeah, the camera's fixed. They're upon us. Bring you back there. Come out at last. What do we mean? Try harder. No, bastard. Damn bastard. The night chief Lucas. Okay, we're running a bit low. Can't go that way. Alright, we're gonna have to make our way to this guy.
Oh, god damn it. Wow, we're getting very spiteful, right? Right, there's some loot over there. And um, how are we going to get it over there? There are, there are sticks over there, so I guess... We just need to burn a path away. I don't know, that doesn't feel like the right thing. I mean, this area was particularly challenging, right? To get through pure PR stealth would have been pretty hard. Right, the herbalist is right over there. Wasn't that where the herbalist was? We're getting there. We're quiet. Guess not. All right. Oh, God, no, please don't. I thought we would need to get to the herbalist. Yes. Which is the way forwards. Not entirely sure. This is probably locked, right? Oh, they've locked it. Calm down. It's an ancient wall. There might be another way. Yes. Let's look. And here it is. Through here. Wow. Yeah, the guilt gets laid on, like, you know, understandably thick when we're killing everybody. But uh, that would be really difficult to get through stealth stealthily because there are so many open sections there where you have to cross in the open. That would have been really difficult. But there was nothing... I guess I was maybe rushing a bit, thinking I could save the herbalist at first, and there was just nothing you could do. He was either going to get stabbed or eaten by the rats. He didn't have a source of light, unless we could maybe have thrown a fire pot over there. Maybe he could have got out, I don't know. But we'll uh, leave it there, guys. Hope you enjoyed this one. <laughs> leave me a thumbs up if you did, and just remember, everyone, never trust an on-crate. I'll see you next time.